Hey y'all, welcome to fourth grade chapter 13, lesson one. We're gonna go ahead and get started with number two. So when we're doing perimeter, um, we're just adding up the sides. That's all it is. Perimeter is pretty easy. It's just adding up all of the sides all the way around. And when you have a square, it's easier because the square, they're the exact same on all sides. So if eight is on all sides and there's four of them, then we're just gonna do eight times four. Okay, so that's gonna get us 32. 32 meters. <clears throat> okay. Now we have 10 and 12. So that's a little bit different. Okay. So 12, 12, 10, 10. We're going to add them up. Okay. 2 plus 2 is 4 plus 0 plus 0, still 4. 1, 2, 3, 4, 44 feet. Okay. Now, if it is easier for you to say, 12 times 2 and 10 times 2 and then add those two together because we would have 24 and 20 and then do 24 plus 20 is 44. You can absolutely do that too. That's another option. Okay. All right. Let's try that on this one. Okay. So I'm going to go 24 times 2 and 30 times 2 and then we're going to add those up. Okay. So 24 times 2 is 48, 30 times 2 is 60, well, 40 and 60 is 100, and then 8, so 100 and 8, okay? You can do this if you need to, it's not a problem, okay? All right, so I want you guys now, well, here, I'll do this last one with you, okay? So this one, I'm going to do it the original way that we've done it. Add them up. 3 plus 3 is 6, plus 5 is 11, plus 5 is 16. Carry our 1. 1 plus 8 is 9, plus 8 more is 17, plus 2 is 19, plus 2 is 21. 216 inches okay this one's a square so they're the same all the way around okay okay troy is measuring a flag shaped like a square each side measures 12 inches so okay he has 36 inches of ribbon does he have enough so first you need to find the perimeter of this then decide if 36 inches is enough and then explain it. Okay, I'm gonna let you guys do that one. Okay. The width of Ocho Community Pool is 20 feet. The length is twice as long as its width. Okay, well, its width is 20 feet. The length is twice as long. Well, twice as long as four as 20 is 40. Okay, so what's the perimeter of the pool? Okay, you guys add them up. What's the perimeter of the pool? Okay, all right. We're going to go over onto the back where you guys are going to do the lesson check, just like always. And we're going to go down and do the review. Okay, all right. Natalie drew the angle below. What is the most reasonable estimate for the measure of the angle Natalie drew? Well, that little box right there tells us it's 90 degrees. Done. Okay. All right. Ethan has three pounds of mixed nuts. How many ounces does he have? Well, three pounds. LBS is pounds, if you'll remember. When one pound is 16 ounces. So now we are going to cancel out our pounds. And we're left with ounces, so that's good. And then we just have to do 3 times 16. Okay. Well, 3 times 6 is 18. Carry the 1. 3 times 1 is 3 plus 1 is 4. 48 ounces. Okay. Okay. How many lines of symmetry does the shape below appear to have? Well... I know that I can cut it straight down the middle here and I can fold it in half, but I can't cut it here. I can't cut it there and I can't cut it there. So one, 
All done. Okay. Anna drank seven tenths of a liter of water before soccer practice and the same amount of water after practice. Compare the two decimals. Adding a zero to the end doesn't change the number. So they're both 0 0.7. 0 0.7, 0 0.70, they're equal. Okay. All right, guys. Thanks for hanging out for 13.1. Come on back for 13.2. See you soon.